Hey there everyone, my name is Nathan and I'm the owner here at Minnesota Mobile Guy. If you're not already familiar with us, we're a business based here in the U.S. state of Minnesota, but we assist customers from all over the world with all sorts of different issues and services on their smartphones, tablets, and other mobile devices. One of the services that our customers most frequently ask us to perform is the SIM unlocking of a mobile device in order to be used with a different carrier or different network than the one that originally sold it. By default, most mobile devices these days are going to come with some sort of lock that restricts them to only being used with the original carrier, and they have to undergo some sort of unlock process in order to be used with a different carrier or a different network. Now, here with us today, we happen to have a Samsung Galaxy A11 that is originally from Cricut here in the U.S and this is a device that has not yet been SIM unlocked because as we can see here with a different carrier SIM card inserted we get this message saying invalid SIM card and it also tells us that the SIM card is network locked and then if we swipe that away and we just go straight to the home screen it's actually curiously not even asking for an unlock code it's not giving us any messages from Cricut whatsoever so it doesn't appear on its face that there appears to be any way to actually get the device sim unlocked so we've had a ton of customers ask us about helping them with this specific issue on this specific device usually either because they themselves wanted to change carriers away from Cricut before meeting the requirements whatever requirements Cricut may have for doing the sim unlock for their customers or because they were sold the device by a dishonest seller who didn't tell them that the device was still locked. The seller claimed that the phone was already unlocked or that it was already eligible to be unlocked through the carrier or something like that and after the purchase the buyer discovered that it wasn't true, that it was all just a lie, the seller had disappeared, the buyer was stuck with a phone that they couldn't use and unfortunately it's a very common scam that happens all the time these days in the buying and selling of used mobile devices. But we're making this video to let any interested customers know that we do offer a service to be able to get this specific model SIM unlocked without having to go through Cricut or meet all of their requirements, whatever those may be. Our unlock procedure is something that we do directly to the device while it is plugged into a computer. And the great thing about this is that it's something that can be done for just about anyone anywhere in the world. So you don't necessarily need to be located here in our local area in order for us to be able to do this for you. you you would just need to have a decently powerful Windows computer along with a fast internet connection and we can remotely connect directly to you right through the internet and perform the exact same procedure that we're doing right here right now. So actually as we speak we are running our unlock program that does the SIM unlock for us and after that we should be able to see that we can indeed register and get signal on the test SIM card that we have inserted here without running into those invalid SIM card messages. Our program is going to need just another minute or two to finish up running here so I'm going to go ahead and fast forward the rest of the video just to jump ahead to the end to keep this as short as possible. So just hold on while that finishes running through. Okay, so I can go ahead and unplug my USB cable here, and actually just looking at the lock screen, I can notice right away that we no longer have the, there's also a network lock message that shows up in the corner before the SIM has been unlocked, but we are no longer seeing that. We're actually showing the name of the carrier that we're registered on, which just happens to be T-Mobile from here in the U.S., and we also don't see that invalid SIM card notification message there anymore. We just have the messages from the games and the other preloaded stuff that Cricut puts on the phone. We're going to go ahead and swipe away the lock screen there. And we don't see any error messages on the screen at all, so that's very good. I'm going to go ahead and jump into the settings here just to take a little bit closer look. If we go down to the About section... And then if we go to Status and SIM Card Status, we can indeed see that we are registered on T-Mobile. We've got our mobile network connected. LTE is all set up, and it looks like the phone is working perfectly. So uh, I'm going to back out back to the About section here just to show you exactly what we're working with. Again, you saw that it was a Galaxy A11, and then the model number there, the SMA115AZ, is the, is the specific model number of the A11 from Cricut. So that is what we're working with here. So if you have a Galaxy A11 originally from Cricut and would like help getting it SIM unlocked for use with other compatible carriers, we would love to help you out with that. So go ahead and get in touch with us. All of our contact information will be right down in the video description. And I'll also put a slide at the end of the video here that has all the details there as well.
While you're here, make sure to check out some of the other videos that we have here on our channel, as we offer a lot of different services for a lot of different devices, and I'm sure you'll find something there that could come in handy someday. Make sure to hit that subscribe button there also to be notified of all the new videos and services that we're constantly adding and putting up, just like this one. Y para todos ustedes hispanohablantes, nosotros también hablamos español, así que ustedes nos pueden contactar sin duda. Thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great rest of your day.